Well, a new warning tonight as bee swarming season is underway. A dog has died after being stung several times this weekend, and the family who owned the dog is recounting their experience only to Channel 13. Reporter Astrid Mendez spoke to them and an expert about what you should do if that happens to you. Swarm or bees around our valley have seen multiple times just this year, the most recent here in Lorenzi Park. In this neighborhood now, one family is mourning the loss of their dog after they were stung, and they hope that this doesn't happen to any other families. But it was already too late. He was dead. He was dead. We couldn't do anything for him. Celia Garcia can help but cry, thinking about what happened to her dog, Bruce. She says her dad was watering the patio when the bees came out of nowhere and stung him and the dog. She got home half an hour after the encounter and tried to save her pet, not realizing bees could kill him. I was desperate trying to help my dog and my neighbor came out and, and went with us outside to try to, to get him from outside, but he was already dead and he got stung more times than we did. Then he called 911 and finally they came. It breaks my heart because that's like a family member. You're going to get me all choked up. Ramona Eubank also got this African bees in her house. Very dangerous and they chased my son and his friend back into the garage. They both say the hive has not been found and a few bees are still in the neighborhood. The Las Vegas Fire Department said since last weekend at least 10 people have gotten stung and that bees get provoked by vibrations and loud noises. Those send vibrations back to the hive and they interpret them as someone trying to break into their home. You start to get headbutted by bees. You should turn around and go in the opposite direction that you were coming from. They're trying to warn you. But if you continue to threaten them, they will sting. And it's when the sting releases and puts that pheromone out, the other bees will come out. The important thing is that if you encounter bees, don't try to take them on alone. Don't even wave your hands because they will actually feel attacked when you do that. And always keep your distance. Astrid Mendes, 13 Action News.